Please welcome John Collins. Designed by the craft's creator, John Collins. John Collins, the man who designed the world record breaking paper airplane. John Collins has been making paper airplanes for over 40 years. Show me the plane that flies world record lengths. Just, just give that a little throat. It's a real plane. <laughs> Did you invent that? Each throw is like a little science experiment. Uh, wow. <laughs> if I take a perfectly adjusted plane and hand it to somebody, they oh, immediately start adjusting it themselves. Kids will, throw. even adults, will oh. immediately start performing their own little experiment, oh, adjusting it nice. to get it to fly better. A new layer sort of happened when, uh, when I started studying origami. I wanted to sort of up the ante a little bit. And no one had really done high performance planes with just folding. Usually people get interested in cutting and pasting, you know, and they, and they give up on just folding to make airfoils. And so I thought, wouldn't it be cool just to be able to take all those tricks from origami, you know, the, the ancient art of Japanese paper folding, take it back to high performance paper airplanes. Okay. Uh, are you, you have a family, you're married, how's it work? <laughs> well, this is a tumbling wing. It's just one long strip of paper with a few creases in it. Look at my man, John. He doesn't even need the cardboard. Whoa, wizard hands. I win, he's speechless. It's Conan! And Pam is looking. No, no, no. <laughs> look at him, look at him. Oh, wow, neat. Hey. They push the air up. My approach has even down. nudged media coverage towards science. Flight is always fascinating, from paper airplanes on up. We ended up on the cover of the Wall Street Journal. Uh, the old world record holder was complaining a little bit, but Guinness seemed to like the idea. The excitement around paper airplanes has grown into an international phenomenon. It's fun, it has universal appeal, and it's also a great platform for important messages from clients or from the heart. We don't have any spare brains on the planet. We need everybody working on the, the global energy shortages, water shortages, food shortages, little thing called global warming. No spare brains. We need, every, we need everybody thinking about this and working on it now. So thank you for coming to uh, Maker Fair. And again, a little fireworks to end the show. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time. John Collins, that was really fun. That was great. Give your next event the fun of flight. I'll throw in a little science for free.